I am back again with another tutorial. This time we are doing the chorus to Hush Hush by Lee Cheyun. This was her solo debut and I loved it. I feel like especially in the case of female idols, we don't get a lot of like very, very themed concepts. Um, they tend to be more nondescript and poetic and well, there's definitely a deeper meaning to Hush Rush. The vampire part of the concept is so prevalent and they stay dedicated to that in their costuming and their dance. And I found it so, so fun. It was an excellent debut and I'm definitely going to keep an eye on what she does in the future. But for now, we're going to learn the chorus. So I won't keep you too long. This entire video is mirrored. Uh, you can follow what you see, but I will try to say as much as I can, whether I'm using my left or my right arm. Um, make sure you stretch and you have something to drink, and let's go! Okay, so the move's broken down. Uh, like I said, this dance is very dedicated to concept, and you see that as soon as it starts, um, we come in right on that little bit where they've edited her voice, so it sounds like she's saying, no, no, no but like really fast. <laughs> I'm assuming that's an edit of some kind. We're going to step down with our left foot here. We just do a quick step. Um, you can start center, step down. And when you step down, you're going to flick your hands. And as I said, this is dedicated to concept. These are your fangs. So we're going to step down and push our hip to the right and bring it all the way to your left. Cross your hands. When you do that, you're going to look over to your right and push your hip back to the right and then come back out, follow your hip. So your hip is following your left hand. So we're doing step, push, and then cross. Come out. And now when we come out, you're going to bring your hip with you back to the left and twist it the other way. Once you get around with that twist, you're going to cross your arms and bring them down to your hips. Keep those fingers out. And when you do that, you're going to do a little step. It's almost like a jump, but your feet don't come up at the same time. So I wouldn't, if you just <laughs> jump, it's not going to look right. So from the beginning, we're going to step, twist, cross, come out, twist and then cross down. So now when we cross down, we're going to come back and step, step. So once this, so you'll pick this right leg up, your right leg will step up first. When you're bringing it down, you'll lift the other leg. It's almost like a skip in that sense. Your feet don't lift up at the same time, but there is like a brief moment where they're both off the ground. So we'll do that again. Step, turn, cross, turn, and step. From here, we're going to start. You're going to keep with the beat of the song, and she just stays bouncy through the whole thing. So we'll land, and you're going to pick up your, this is your right hand, but it's crossed over, so the hand that's on your left side. You're going to pick it up, and when you do, you're going to follow with your heel and your hip. And you do each hip, and then you keep bouncing, and then you flick out. So we'll go over that a little more. <laughs> Let's swoop down, push, cross, push. Ooh, I'm standing on my pants. And now we're bouncing. Pick up, pick up, bounce, bounce. It's about two bounces that you get in there. One, two, and then you're going to pull your arms up, and do a full circle to land like this. So your left hand, both your hands are in fists now. Your left hand is kind of just angled up and out, and your right hand is straight up and or straight out and down. <laughs> so we'll step, push, push, bounce, bounce, and then you do that. So when your hands land, you should be facing over to your left side. And when you first start to turn, you're going to kick this foot up uh, just to land in front of you. You'll keep that bounciness and face the camera again, or your audience, or your mirror, or whoever's watching you, maybe just your wall, your dog. <laughs> I definitely dance for my dog a lot. 
All right, so we'll start from here. Push out, push out, bounce, bounce, and then twist. Then you're gonna bounce while you go forward. And this kind of matches up with the music. Um, there's a lot of layering vocals and editing vocals that happen in this song, which makes it sound good, but it's, it can make it a little more difficult to explain where the points are. If you see the dance with the music, then the timing becomes a lot more clear. But we bounce and we turn around. And then we're going to do that same thing with our, our hands. <laughs> but instead of kicking this foot up, we're going to step this one back. So from here... Push out, push out, bounce, bounce, twist. Turn to look and twist. And now you don't have a lot of time. This isn't held the same way. So after you've turned, you're pretty much immediately going to step out and put your hands on your head. And now this part, I know she says that I don't care. So for that, you're going to sway to your right, sway to your left, like you're listening to a really good song, come up and forward and down. You'll let your hands kind of drift off your head. So we'll go from that, from right here. Push, push, bounce, bounce, then twist and land, and then twist and step. Lean, lean, center. And now for this, she kind of just brings her body down. I feel like that I really, I really enjoy like the vibes of this dance for lack of better terms. So I do tend to lean into it a little more. Uh, with that lift, you come up center. She kind of just does this. I tend to drop my head a little. I feel like it just makes it seem like you're a little more lost in it. And with that hush rush energy of an exciting love, I feel like it just adds to it. I don't know. That's just me. <laughs> I like to do my, my own thing. <laughs> so we'll go from here. You step out and you lean, lean, center, down. From here, you're going to pop your head right and then left. And while you do that, you're going to kind of wiggle your hip while you step backwards. Um, so where are we? Right here. <laughs> So you're going to come down and then step, 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 yeah, yeah, that's the move, here, step, I don't care, one, two, and then from that, <laughs> there we go, one, two, and so from here you're just going to step once and you put your hands you're going to turn to face the right but not all the way you don't want to be sideways you want to be angled and then you're just going to put your hands out uh like a really cutesy look they're doing a bit of they're adding a bit of sweetness to the dance so we've step step come so you bring this leg in a little bring your hands down and then you step now you want to lean into it with your chest but keep your head up and that it kind of adds to that that cute sort of posed look that it has. So you're gonna step, step, and then bring yourself back to center and kick your right leg out to land, facing away. There's a kind of specific beat and you twist and look at the audience. And then this one is definitely a prominent beat. You're gonna bring your hands up, uh, bring them up quickly, and then control that movement, let them drift down slowly. like. It Bursting off your head. Uh, we'll go over that again. <laughs> so let's go from, you were just turned that way, you land. Da, 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 oh, over. So you were just this way, and you step. Da, da, center, I don't care. Step, step. Land, step, step, center, kick, land. And now you want this leg to be straight. Your right leg should be straight. Your left leg can bend at the knee a little bit to help support that lean, because you want to be far over. And then if you can manage it, a little hair flick wouldn't be bad. 
So twist, and then you're going to feel that bend happen more in your left leg when you twist to look. And then you bring your hands up quick and slowly release them down. And through the whole dance, when we're not doing like our fangs, she does like this open hand. They aren't like locked and they're kind of splayed open. It's um, like a stylistic posing for your hands. And that's what you're going to do here. You'll see it several other times. So after you've brought your hands up and you've slowly popped them down, you're going to jump back to center, push this hand up, and bring this one near your cheek. And you don't want to land fully if you're just standing flat. It takes away from some of the energy. But you'll land, and then you, you kind of like pat your butt in. <laughs> and you're going to do the same thing with your cheek. So we'll go over that from... From I don't care. You're gonna drop, step, step, land. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then you'll do your, do your two taps. From here, it's gonna be a quick step. You wanna bring this foot center and forward, and then you can pull that one out. And you can leave it on your toe, leave your heel off the ground, and you wanna just sort of Angle it into your body a little bit. Um, it, it'll come very organically. It's a little stiff the first few times I tried to do the dance. I found it was quick and it was kind of difficult to get. But once you know to go there, it comes very naturally. Go from here. So you're going to tap twice. And then you're going to tap your cheeks on the stage. Now, <laughs> I shouldn't say stage. She says stage. Um, I don't know whether it's her accent or the um, way they chose to enunciate it for the song. It sounds like sad. <laughs> but um, you're going to tap, and then you're going to bring it off slowly. Like, um, there's a lot of power control in this dance. You want to get the vibe of, like, being swept up in love and, like, occasionally coming back to yourself and slowing down. <laughs> so we're going to bring that from the top because we're, like, halfway through the chorus, I'd say. So, once again, you're going to step, land, twist, bring it over here, follow, bring it back, twist around, step, pull up, pull up, bounce, bounce, and land with your big twist. And now step back from center, and then da, da, da. I don't care. Flick, flick, land. One, two, land. Kick, one, two, and bring it slow, and then jump up. Pat, pat, and then so you'll bring your feet in while you get your hands tapping at your cheeks. Tap, tap, one, two. And then here the music kind of picks up a bit, so does the dance. That, that first bit, the bit we've done just now is kind of like the challenge. Uh, it's what you see in a lot of shorts and TikToks. But the chorus does keep going. So you're going to go one, two. Remember, your heel's off the ground. So you'll bring this leg in. You bring this one in a little too. You're going to bring it in a little and then step. So your hands are going to go close fingers. This palm up and this palm down. Tap, tap. And so you're just changing from facing to the right to the left. Over that again. So we're right here. Tap, tap on this stage. So you bring this leg in and then tap, 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 and bring your arms down. At this point, she does the the bit where she's going, I love it, I love it, I love it. Uh, and so you're kind of just following that with your taps. And so we are going to go one, uh, one, two, bring it down. You're going to tap, tap. I don't want to hit my mic, but it's tap, tap on your chest, facing the right. Tap, tap on your legs, facing the left. And then facing forward, you're going to bring one hand up and sort of push yourself down and then jump up. We'll go over that again. 
um, from right here. Tap, tap, out, out. Bring this leg in and step, step, come down, tap, 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 tap. And when you switch these, you're going to do a little jump. So at a full speed, it's a little quicker. Uh, da, 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 tap, 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 and then go down. When you go down, you can just leave this hand out beside you, and you want to follow that down with your hip. So the way your head leans, your hip's going to push that same direction. And then you jump up. So again, that's about that power and control. You're going to lean all the way down slowly and jump up quick. From here, you're going to swoop down with this little three fingers up and then making a circle. You're going to swoop down and land it on your eye. You're going to lean forward for that. Lean forward, swoop up. And then when you land down, you're going to bend this knee and sort of sit into this leg. And you're going to bounce just a little bit. And she's going to pull it out. Now, they don't pull it up too far. Um, but it also doesn't, it's not like a tiny movement. So you want to get like, you're not going to go out here, but you're also not going to stay right here. Kind of going in the middle there. So we've landed. We look out and we switch. So we've landed and we twist both. So your heels will come off the ground as a very simple twist on your toes or the balls of your feet. So go from here. So you drop down and you come up. Swoop down and land up. And then you want one, two bounces. After that second bounce, we're gonna turn in a circle. And when we do, we're gonna do this little toe tappy where we're changing our, which leg is pushed out. So we've landed. And so you jump out this leg. So right, left, right, left. And then you grab out and you land on that right again. We'll go over that one again. <laughs> um, so we've land, uh, swoop out, land. Pull it out, come in, bounce, bounce. One, two, three, four, five. We bring it in, and so then we're gonna bring our hands across our chest, and you wanna like swoop your wrist a little bit. You wanna stylize this as much as possible. Uh, the moves aren't difficult, but they're very, I guess I would say elegant. There's a very nice natural flow to them. Um, which I believe is supposed to feed into that feeling of love, which is a very organic emotion. Um, so you don't want stiff movements. You want to kind of, you can stylize it as much as you want or as little as you want, but the more you stylize it, the more it's going to look like it's nice and it fits your dance style and those kinds of things. Um, uh, so we just tapped our toes and then we go out and in. So this right leg, you're going to bend it at the knee, lift it off the toe and point it out, but this stays facing forward. And we've just grabbed. So now we're going to wrap our hands around ourselves, and when we do, we're going to step this leg out. It allows you to kind of twist and face the left a little bit. So we've grabbed and land. We're going to twist. And then you're going to twist your hands out again and push them out. That's flat closed palms and switch legs. So let's go from that halfway point to the chorus where we end the first half of the chorus right here. Tap, 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 tap. And then you're gonna bring that leg in and step, step, bring them down. Tap, 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 tap. Go down and up. Swoop and land. Come out, in. Bounce, bounce, tap, 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 and grab. And then you're going to come in and push out. So that's a pretty quick weight change. Um, if balance, um, being bouncy is something you struggle with, this is a great dance to practice because it's very bouncy without being too complicated. Right, so we'll come in and push out. After that, we're gonna kind of take these steps back before we land feet center. So push out, 
And so then you kind of step, you put your hands here, 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 and then up. So you can kind of, <laughs> I kind of just grab my hands, however it is. Um, so we'll land, cross, push out, one, two, three, four, five. And so for here, I try to be standing center by this part, and then you can kind of do a jump out. You're going to jump up, and you're going to kick your leg out and drag it in. It's a very flowy movement. There's not, at no point should you rest your leg weight on this leg. It's all here right now. You're like, you're on a post. <laughs> so we've come up and step once. So on the second step, you're going to slowly bring your hands down. It's another one of those pops that you see. So you'll bring your hands down with your leg, rest them on your thighs, and just do two chest pops. And then we will step our left leg out and bring your hand around to pull your hair to the side. This is one dance that, I mean, you can do with like a ponytail. You could definitely do it with a ponytail because you can still get this part done, but you couldn't really accomplish this dance successfully in like a bun. It does use your hair like in a move. Uh, so we're here. You step, step, land, pop, pop. Now you'll shift your weight back to this leg and step this one out. And you want it out, but just straight for just a second there. You'll bring your ha hair over and you're going to rub, rub, rub. And that kind of guides your knee into bent. And then you'll just step and wave your hips while you play with your hair. And then now each chorus ends a little differently. The first chorus goes into the second. The second, the second verse, the second chorus goes, uh, and she kind of stops dancing to prepare for the breakdown. And then the third chorus, I don't know if we even do this part because um, she's coming up front and center to step her leg forward for that end chorus. So they all end differently. Personally, I'm a big fan of the way the first chorus ends because you get a little hair flip and a little shoulder, I don't know, what is that, a roll, a pop? Um, but for the purpose of this tutorial, I'll teach you how the second chorus starts. Very simple, uh, you do this, and then you step, and you kind of pet your hair, and then she says, living, living my sweet, I probably should have Googled the lyrics first, and she flicks her hair, this hand will come down, and then this shoulder just rolls with the heavy beat you hear that. And that's it. Wah! Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's go over all the moves from the top. Okay, taking it from the top, we're going to land and twist, turn and twist, and then do our little step. Pop up and up, bounce, bounce, twist. Come back and then step back, center. One, two, three, and drop. Step, step, land, step, step, land, step, twist. Bring your hands up and drop them down. And we're gonna bounce, bounce. Come center for our taps on the stage. Bring your leg in, step. Come down. I love it. I love it. I love it. Jump. Swoop up and land. Out. Bounce. Bounce. One, two, three, four, five. Then we come out. We come in. Or the other way around. We come in. We come out. Step, 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 step. Up. Then you're going to one and pop and bring your hands down, land, two chest pops. Step your leg out, and bring your hair around. One, two, three. I love it, I love it, I love it. End of the chorus. Bum, bum, bum. Ah, oh my goodness, you did so well. 
my follow along tutorial my practice video will be up tomorrow i hope this was helpful please let me know if there's anything i can do or change about these tutorials to make them more useful for you um, and please let me know if you find them helpful at all it'd be good to know <laughs> um, thank you so much for watching let me know if you have any requests and go have something to drink make sure you stretch bye yeah.